Have you ever asked yourself, why is my skin getting thinner, duller, and more fragile, even though I'm doing everything right? If that resonates, you're not alone. According to a study published in Dermatoendocrinology 2012, women can lose up to 30% of their collagen within the first five years of menopause. That loss isn't just cosmetic. It affects your skin's strength, hydration, and ability to repair itself. So what exactly is collagen? Collagen is the most abundant protein in your body. Think of it as the scaffolding that holds your skin, joints, and bones together. It gives skin its firmness, smoothness, and elasticity. But as we age, collagen production slows down, starting as early as age 25, and factors like sun exposure, smoking, poor diet, and hormonal shifts accelerate this decline. Unfortunately, many people try to reverse this by simply taking collagen supplements, expecting overnight miracles. Here's the problem. Collagen is a large protein that must be broken down into peptides to be absorbed. Without the right cofactors like vitamin C, zinc, and amino acids, your body can't rebuild collagen effectively, no matter how much you ingest. This video goes beyond the hype. You'll discover the top 10 nutrients backed by clinical evidence that actually stimulate collagen production from within and how to make them work for you. I'll also share peer-reviewed scientific articles that prove how the right nutrition can support collagen synthesis, protect your skin from aging, and restore its natural resilience. If you've ever felt like your skincare routine isn't enough or that aging is outpacing your efforts, this is the guide you've been waiting for. Let's restore your skin from the inside out. Top nutrients for collagen production. To effectively rebuild collagen, your body needs more than just collagen peptides. It requires a symphony of nutrients that serve as building blocks, catalysts, and protectors. Let's start by exploring five of the most well-researched nutrients that support collagen synthesis at a cellular level. Number one, vitamin C. Vitamin C isn't just important, it's essential. Without it, your body literally cannot make collagen. It acts as a cofactor for two critical enzymes, prolyl hydroxylase and LYSYL hydroxylase, which stabilize and cross-link collagen molecules, giving them strength and structure. According to a review in Nutrients 2017, even a moderate deficiency in vitamin C can lead to weakened skin, delayed wound healing, and dryness. But here's something most people miss. Vitamin C is water-soluble and must be replenished daily. The recommended dietary allowance, RDEA, is 75 mg for women and 90 mg for men, but those amounts are based on preventing scurvy, not optimizing skin health. Studies show that 200 to 500 mg daily may be more appropriate for enhancing skin elasticity and moisture. Best sources, red bell peppers, more vitamin C than oranges, Kiwis, strawberries, broccoli. Tip, take vitamin C with meals rich in collagen or protein. It enhances absorption and utilization. Number two, vitamin B12. While not directly a collagen cofactor, vitamin B12 is crucial for cell division, red blood cell formation, and DNA synthesis, all essential for maintaining skin integrity and supporting tissue regeneration. Older adults, especially those over 60, often have lower stomach acid levels, making it harder to absorb B12 from food. According to the National Institutes of Health, up to 15% of Americans over 60 are deficient. B12 also plays a role in controlling homocysteine, a compound that, when elevated, is linked to accelerated skin aging and decreased collagen formation. Best sources, animal-based foods like salmon, eggs, and liver. For vegetarians slash vegans, supplement with methylcobalamin or cyanocobalamin B12. Tip, sublingual B12 is better absorbed than oral tablets for some individuals. Number three, zinc. Zinc is another essential mineral that supports the enzymes needed for collagen synthesis and tissue remodeling. It also plays a vital role in skin immunity, reducing inflammation and aiding in wound healing. A study published in the American Journal of Clinical Nutrition, 2007, found that even mild zinc deficiency impairs collagen production and increases skin fragility. What's concerning is that nearly one in five people worldwide are zinc deficient, especially older adults, vegetarians, 
and those with gastrointestinal conditions. Best sources, oysters, pumpkin seeds, chickpeas, beef. Supplement tip, limit zinc supplementation to under 40 milligrams per day unless advised by a doctor. High doses can deplete copper levels over time. Number four, beta carotene. Beta carotene is a plant pigment that the body converts into vitamin A, another skin essential. It protects collagen fibers from degradation by UV radiation and oxidative stress. This antioxidant property helps maintain skin firmness and reduce wrinkle depth. A 2016 study in the Journal of Investigative Dermatology showed that diets rich in beta carotene led to visibly improved skin tone and texture in aging populations. Best sources, sweet potatoes, carrots, butternut squash, tomato paste. Tip, beta carotene is fat soluble. Always consume it with a source of healthy fat, e.g. olive oil or avocado, to enhance absorption. Number five, sulforaphane. Sulforaphane is a sulfur-rich compound found in cruciferous vegetables. It doesn't directly build collagen, but activates the body's detox pathways and antioxidant systems, notably the NRF2 pathway. This reduces chronic inflammation and protects fibroblasts, the cells that produce collagen, from oxidative damage. In a 2019 study published in Scientific Reports, Sulforaphane was shown to increase skin elasticity and reduce signs of photoaging. Best sources, broccoli sprouts, highest, kale, Brussels sprouts. Tip, lightly steam your cruciferous veggies. Overcooking destroys sulforaphane. To maximize potency, chop and let sit for 10 minutes before cooking. Number six, chlorophyll. Chlorophyll is the pigment that gives plants their vibrant green color but it does much more than provide visual appeal. Within the human body, chlorophyll serves as a potent antioxidant, anti-inflammatory agent, and even a mild antimicrobial compound. These properties make it an ideal candidate for skin health, especially in supporting collagen preservation and synthesis. One of the most compelling studies on chlorophyll was published in Clinical, Cosmetic, and Investigational Dermatology, 2015 where researchers found that both topical and dietary forms of chlorophyll led to increased skin elasticity and reduced wrinkle depth in middle-aged women. This study gave scientific backing to a long-held belief in natural health circles, that greens do more than nourish, they restore. Chlorophyll's indirect support of collagen comes primarily through detoxification. By binding to toxins and heavy metals in the liver and bloodstream, it helps reduce systemic inflammation, a major culprit in collagen degradation. Chronic inflammation accelerates the breakdown of the extracellular matrix, the structural network that collagen maintains. Additionally, chlorophyll's rich magnesium content plays a cofactor role in more than 300 enzymatic reactions in the body, including those involved in skin repair and regeneration. For aging women, especially postmenopausal, Increasing magnesium-rich chlorophyll intake may help counteract the natural hormonal decline that impairs collagen renewal. Best dietary sources of chlorophyll include spinach, parsley, alfalfa, arugula, wheatgrass, and chlorella. Just a few tablespoons of cooked spinach daily can make a difference in overall skin resilience. For those who struggle to get enough greens, chlorophyll supplements, available in liquid or capsule form, are convenient alternative. However, it's essential to choose high-quality, organic products without added synthetic colors or preservatives. A word of caution, while chlorophyll is generally safe, excessive intake can lead to minor gastrointestinal discomfort, including nausea or green-tinted stools. Always start with a low dose and build up gradually. Number seven, phytoestrogens. Collagen production in women is heavily influenced by estrogen which plays a key role in maintaining skin thickness, hydration, and elasticity. As estrogen levels drop during and after menopause, many women notice that their skin becomes thinner, more fragile, and less resilient. Phytoestrogens are naturally occurring plant compounds that can mimic estrogen's effects in the body by binding to estrogen receptors. While not as potent as synthetic hormones, they offer a safer, more natural alternative to hormone replacement therapy, HRT. According to a randomized controlled trial published in Menopause, 2009, 
Women who consumed four servings of soy-based foods daily for six months experienced measurable improvements in skin thickness and collagen fiber density. Soy isoflavones, the most studied class of phytoestrogens, have been shown to activate fibroblasts, the cells responsible for collagen production. They also reduce enzymes like matrix metalloproteinases, MMPs, that break down collagen in the skin. Excellent sources of phytoestrogens include soybeans, tofu, tempeh, miso, flax seeds, chickpeas, and lentils. Incorporating soy milk into a morning smoothie or adding tofu to salads can be both skin-friendly and heart-healthy. Flax seeds are particularly valuable as they also provide omega-3 fatty acids that reduce skin inflammation. However, women with a history of hormone-sensitive cancers, such as breast or ovarian cancer, should consult their healthcare provider before significantly increasing phytoestrogen intake. While studies suggest these compounds may have protective effects, personalized guidance is crucial. Number eight, protein. It's easy to forget that collagen itself is a protein. Without a steady intake of dietary protein, particularly the amino acids glycine, proline, and lysine, the body cannot synthesize new collagen fibers effectively. These amino acids are found in both animal and plant-based sources, though in differing ratios. Older adults often face challenges in meeting their protein needs. Sarcopenia, the age-related loss of muscle mass, also impairs the body's ability to repair and regenerate skin tissue. While the RDA for protein is 0.8 grams per kilogram of body weight, experts suggest that older individuals may benefit from consuming between 1.2 to 1.5 grams per kilogram. Sources of high-quality protein include lean poultry, fish, eggs, legumes, Greek yogurt, and quinoa. For better absorption and consistent amino acid availability, it's recommended to spread protein intake evenly across meals. Consuming 20 to 30 grams of protein per meal may help maximize collagen and muscle synthesis. While protein is vital, the source matters. Red and processed meats have been associated with higher levels of inflammation, which can counteract the benefits of protein on skin health. A Mediterranean-style diet rich in fish, legumes, and plant-based proteins tends to support better skin aging outcomes. Number 9. Green Tea Green tea, long celebrated in Easter medicine, is a rich source of catechins, potent antioxidants that combat free radical damage reduce UV-induced skin injury, and protect existing collagen from breakdown. A 12-week randomized trial published in the Journal of Nutrition, 2011, found that women who consumed green tea daily showed significant improvements in skin elasticity, hydration, and roughness. Beyond its antioxidant power, green tea also has anti-inflammatory properties that soothe irritated skin and promote a more even tone. Drinking one to two cups of brewed green tea each day can yield visible benefits. Loose leaf green tea tends to offer higher quality than pre-packaged bags, and brewing it without milk enhances catechin absorption. Adding lemon juice can further stabilize these antioxidants in the digestive tract. Green tea extract is also found in many skincare products, but topical and oral use together appears to be most effective. Some people may experience mild sensitivity to caffeine. In that case, decaffeinated versions still retain most of the beneficial compounds. Number 10. Collagen Peptides Collagen peptides, also known as hydrolyzed collagen, have exploded in popularity, but not all products are created equal. For collagen to be absorbed, it must be broken down into smaller peptides that the body can utilize. Molecular weight amino acid profile, and source all play a role in a supplement's effectiveness. In a double-blind, placebo-controlled study published in Skin Pharmacology and Physiology, 2014, women who took 2.5 grams of collagen peptides daily for eight weeks experienced improved skin elasticity and reduced wrinkle depth. The improvements were more significant in women over 50. Marine collagen from fish and bovine collagen from grass-fed cows are the most common sources, typically offering type 1 and 3 collagen, the forms most abundant in skin. For optimal benefits, collagen should be paired with vitamin C and zinc, which are required cofactors for collagen synthesis. 
Look for collagen supplements that are third-party tested for purity and heavy metal content. Some cheaper products may be contaminated with toxins like mercury or lead, particularly those derived from low-quality fish or animal parts. For vegetarians or those hesitant to use animal-derived products, plant-based collagen boosters, such as bamboo silica, amla extract, and glycine-rich plant proteins, can stimulate your body's own collagen production pathways. Ultimately, collagen peptides work best as part of a comprehensive strategy that includes nutrient-dense foods, targeted supplementation, and lifestyle practices like sun protection and stress reduction. They are not magic pills, but when used consistently, they can be a powerful tool in your skin renewal toolkit. Real story number one, how nutrition helped an elderly woman heal a pressure wound. Mrs. Daniels was 78 when she entered a rehab center after a hip surgery. Within days, she developed a pressure ulcer on her lower back. It was painful, inflamed, and healing poorly. The medical team did everything, topical creams, antibiotics, but it wasn't enough. That's when we looked at her nutrition. Her protein was way too low. So we bumped it up, added collagen peptides, daily vitamin C, zinc, and greens for extra chlorophyll. And guess what? In just three weeks, her skin started to regenerate. By the end of eight weeks, the wound had healed. She felt stronger, more energetic, and proud of how far she came. This wasn't just about medicine. It was about giving her body the raw materials it needed. Nutrition doesn't replace treatment, but without it, the body can't do what it's designed to do. Heal. Real story number two, skin recovery after chronic illness. Carla, 64, had survived breast cancer, but chemo, radiation, and hormone blockers had left her skin dull, fragile, and easily irritated. She tried every serum, moisturizer, and facial you can imagine. Nothing helped. When we met, we talked food. She swapped sugary snacks for protein-rich meals, added flax and tofu for phytoestrogens, drank green tea daily, and loaded her plate with leafy greens. Two months later, she emailed me a photo. Her skin looked different, brighter, smoother, alive. She wrote, I finally feel like my body's on my side again. That line stuck with me. Her skin didn't change overnight, but with consistency and the right nutrients, it responded. Sometimes the answer isn't more products, it's giving your body what it needs to rebuild from the inside out. Aging is natural, but how we age is something we can influence every single day. If there's one thing I hope you take from this video, it's that skin health starts inside. You don't need perfect genetics or a shelf full of expensive products. You just need to give your body the tools it needs to do what it already knows how to do. Repair, rebuild, and renew. Here are three golden rules for radiant skin after 60. Hashtag one feed your skin daily with collagen building nutrients like vitamin C, protein, and zinc. Number two, protect what you've got with antioxidants from green tea, leafy greens, and colorful veggies. Number three, support your hormones naturally with phytoestrogens and anti-inflammatory foods. Your skin can still glow, still heal, still surprise you at any age. If this resonated with you, don't miss my next video where we dive into how stress and sleep impact collagen and what you can do starting tonight. See you there.